Okay, hello there everyone. Welcome to, well, this morning's video. I would like to show you guys a new cool feature I found all thanks to Weatherman Plus. So earlier during my stream, Weatherman Cl Plus briefly came over and uh, told me, recommended me that I use vidIQ. Now, Initially, I'm wondering, hmm, well, what could that be? Well, I will tell you right now, in a short sentence, very awesome. And I'm going to show you how exactly it is very awesome, as I say. So, you may have noticed, or already know some differences on my screen. Especially towards up here and there. But I will show you those guys those later now to show you guys the site itself so by the way vidIQ you can either go on the main site itself like I am right now and just click sign up with your Google account then also it is definitely recommended that you download the extension just so that you get even more features and then on YouTube you'll have thing on the side that says sign of Google, then that's when it also appears on YouTube. So here's the site itself. So you notice in the last seven days, I have had 1,022 views, which is 33,966.7% above normal. 14 more subscribers, which is 180% above normal. 41.8 hours watch time, which is 667% above normal. But then the retention's awful. That is going to need to work on. But then you'll see keyword opportunities. Now, this is based on the channel you have. So, obviously, mine's based on weather. So, the three most common and most competitive keyword terms terms are weather, tornadoes, and tornado one. Now here it shows you the amount of searches this has had in a certain amount of time. You can see the competition is really high. I mean, it's going to be less likely that you'll have someone come over to your channel as a result, but at least on my side of things, so I've actually had the better of it. Like, I've actually had more people come over to my channel with these search terms, despite them being very high in competition. So as you can see, there's uh, only a 38 of 100% chance that you'll have one, then 34 out of 100 for this one, and a 50 out of 100. So it's a 50-50 probability you would get some of the tornado warning. Then here you'll see the monetization tracker. This is for people like me who aren't quite mon who aren't monetized just quite yet. So as you can see, I currently have 176 subscribers, but then I have a long way to go. And then watch time hours. I have in order to be monetized other than the 1,000 subscribers. I have to have four thousand public watch time hours within 12 months so that would expire on december 26 and july 19th which by the way wait a minute i just remembered today is the second anniversary of the july 19th 2019 derecho that came through here so thinking what i'm gonna do for today to celebrate it I will be live, or actually no, not live. I will make a video about it, what happened, how major it was, and show you detailed radar runs of just how it evolved through, with time. But anyways, and then you'll see this competitor section. Now, whether today, please do also subscribe to him other than Wireman Plus, subscribe to him. I will have both of their channels at the description below but where today's just a test subject for this just to show you guys how it works 
So I've seen the last seven days, even though I've had more views than him overall. Wait till you see the slaughter that lies ahead for me. So as you can see, with views, so let's put this to 12 plus. As you can see, he has had way more views than me. And then th this was a period in which I was inactive for a long time. I was very busy with school now. And then, then this is where I become active again. And then, boom. Then there's today. Well, two days ago, actually. That doesn't allow me any further, but anyways. 21,889 and then 10,215. But point being is, he beats me by a mile with this. Same thing for subscribers. Now, I don't know why it starts me off later, but whatever. As you can see, he also beats me in subscriber count. But you also notice with the views, like when I was inactive, some days I would actually lose one or right, the game. But then. I became active, and sure enough, more subscribers. Now, other than the views in the last seven days, this is the only other thing I beat him at. It's the number of videos. I am infamous for posting a lot of videos, and, well, more recently, live streams. Average daily views, so he beats me by a lot. You can't even see me. Whoa. Look at that. Wow. I have been overshadowed significantly. And then there he is. Ha 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 ha. And then same button. I increased by 0.1. Still can't even see me. Hello there. So there's that. In the top videos from your competitors as well. So. My case, damn team wins in central Pennsylvania. And then you have. Weather forecast for July 16th, 2021, and after. So there's that. And then. Again, here's this. So as you can see, I beat him for the seven days. And for the 14 days, but then he beats me for the 28 days. So there's that. And then also, once you've had this for long enough, which is one to three days, basically, as long as you're publishing videos within 70 to 90 day as as long as you publish a video between 70 and 90 days ago it will work it actually gives you ideas on what to make which i find pretty cool myself like obviously i have a lot of ideas like i'm about to be making another one about multiple rounds of severe weather for the midwest coming up but still cool i mean what else offers you ideas on what to make? You probably couldn't think of anything. I can tell you right now, I sure could have, wouldn't be able to think of anything before. But then again, once you download the extension and sign into your Google account on YouTube, then you can actually see up here. Once it appears. There. You'll see up here in this bar right here. As long as you have checked these boxes. As you can see, I've had 159 watch time hours in the last month. I mean, last year. Oh, someone watched within the 60 minutes. Hmm. And then 458 views in the last two days, 1,400 some views in the last seven days, and 3,900 
thousand watch time minutes in the last seven, seven days, and then so a total of one hundred seventy six subscribers. Thank you all. But then you'll also notice this screen one hundred percent. Now you may be wondering, man, what are those? So it is sometimes red, but. That is the like to dislike ratio. So, for example, on this live stream, I had seven likes but zero dislikes. So I find that cool. And you don't see that on only your just your videos. You can see that on all of your other um friends' videos, even people you just don't even know. Any video you come across, you will see. Either green, yellow, or red colored percentages based on the like to dislike ratio. And then you will also notice again these up here. But then you can also view channel audit. Wait for it to load. So as you can see. The views have gone up 149%. So, as you can see, last month I had a measly 809. But so far this month I've had 2017. Pretty good. As for subscribers, I gained 10 last month. This month I gained 25. Last month I only had 2016 minutes worth of watch time. But then this month I've had 5,092 minutes. Views per hour, I've had 1 VPH for this. And then engagement rate, these are the highest. And then here's the highest in views for a certain amount of time for the past month. And then here's videos that actually gave me subscribers. Now, one thing, comment, these are all, um, you know, live streams. Gain one with each of those. And then, obviously, you can upgrade. That requires money, but. I mean, once I monetize, other than getting the radar and all, uh, improved radar and all, I mean, if I were to have enough left over, I would easily want to spend it to upgrade this. So then again, here's watch time minutes. So the most. And an average watch time is 1 minutes 45 seconds. Top retention. This one had the people most interested in. Top playlist. Well, well then you can see the top suggested videos that I do not own. So... People on my channel have them watched Live Severe Water Live, Live Western Great Lakes, and then Tropical Storm Gilermo. And then obviously there's more, but then again, yeah, I would have to upgrade. Then, top search terms Severe Water Live, Severe Weather Tornado, Weatherman Plus. Hmm, strange. May 3rd, 1999 Tornado and Tornado Live. Then end screens again, I need to add more, but someone actually subscribed with the end screen. On one video I randomly put on, which I'm impressed. But then these are the ones with the lowest views in the past days. Wow. And then you can see Average metrics over the last 30 days. So as you can see here, I'm not doing so shabby with these, but I mean, obviously, now that it's recommended them, I can improve on that. Okay, so yep, it is within the next 30 days. And then I would have to upgrade in order to 
see the others. So then again, I'm gonna then show you something cool. Here's where the magic happens. Now, as you can see here, 16.2 alpha on 100 vid IQ score, and then 0 0.3 views per hour, and then 42 views. For social, the engagement rate is pretty incredible, actually, for this video. But then, the SEO score is pretty low, though. Ridiculously low. Then the number of their videos, so videos for me, so right here where the suggested videos bar would typically be. So, out of the 20 suggested videos, 7 of those would be from me. This is the number for it's in the description. And then, then here's the description link account, so that's the tags I added. And then here, the number of external web pages. So say you have your own website or Facebook or whatever. If you were to link this video to this, to it, then this will pop up. Now, as you can see, I have two field tags, and I have a line of description. Not enough cards. Not enough end screens. A high res thumbnail which is good in the closed captions manual reply to a recent comment shared on Facebook monetization enabled added to a playlist and then public and then it quick shows you quick stats from the channel in which it's mine very nova then no channel tags and then I have this online style Okay, I don't remember that, but whatever. In a vehicle. So, yeah. So, well, that's one of the videos for tonight. Hope you enjoyed this. Use it now. It will help you. So, again, thanks to Wireman Plus, and please do subscribe to him, me, and Wire, Wire Today, but also to all of my friends. So, and then, that's another thing. I forgot to mention, but you can actually have, you can actually copy cards, copy the end screen, use an advanced embedded link, but then also you can do a thumbnail editor, so like you could pause scenes from this. So, I mean, I already did. And then you could do a solid image or say I pause the screen then I could have the image here and then so yeah see as you can see I have this on maximum resolution available for the thumbnail while you drive for conditions so yeah then obviously you could change the font change where you can place it. I didn't figure that out yet. I will eventually, but. Then you can enter the text here. And yeah. So, that's the video for today. Enjoy.